Hello there once again, I am David DeFranco from Squarespace Summit over at sspacesummit.com. And in this video tutorial, I am going to show you the easiest way to set up an email list sign up form on your Squarespace website. This is very useful if you're interested in building your email list like I am. For instance, scrolling down a bit, you'll see that I have my email list sign up form right here where it says follow in my footsteps learn the tips and secrets behind creating an online career signing up is free and easy and just convenient for the user okay so as usual getting started press the escape key on your keyboard to bring up the site manager view and then click on pages okay so this is where you want to either select or create a new page for this video's purpose let's just create a new page by clicking the plus icon and selecting page and let's just call this test page. Now keep in mind, you can add an email address sign up form on any page. Okay, so let's hover anywhere in the white space on your page's content, click edit, and then click any of the add content bubbles, scroll down a bit, and select newsletter. Okay, so this is where you can easily customize your newsletter block. For example, you can require a name field, checking that automatically brings up two new text fields for first name and last name. And scrolling down, you can see that we currently have a sign up button. I'll explain how to change that in a bit. But for now, we can change the title of this sign up form. So let's call this sign up for my email newsletter. It's free. And as you can see, that title automatically displays above my sign up form. And right down here, we can change the description, but in my opinion, to make things a little more simple, let's simply get rid of it. And down here is your disclaimer. Because privacy is very important to the average person, you might want to include a little disclaimer here saying that your email address will never be shared, your privacy will be respected, or anything else that applies. But for now, let's click on storage. And this is where you can customize how your email newsletter sign up form basically talks to other services such as Google Docs or, in my experience, MailChimp. All right, so let's click on MailChimp and I can connect my MailChimp account to Squarespace. Let's log in. So as you can see, Squarespace automatically loaded my MailChimp account once I logged in and I can select from any of these lists, including my personal list and BrandRocket over at BrandRocket.com. So let's click on Advanced. And this is where I can customize that sign up button that I talked about previously. So we can change that to Submit. And down here is a post submit message. Just like the contact form video that I did a little while back, this is where basically you can thank people for signing up. So usually a simple thank you is all you need, but you're free to put anything you want here, including a URL. But for now, let's click save and that button will automatically update to submit. Actually, let's do a simple refresh. There you go, submit. Now, as you can see, it's kind of large, but obviously I can customize that further on but it is incredibly simple and it's free. Oh, and also by the way, MailChimp is completely free to sign up for and use as long as you don't have more than 2000 email subscribers. That's just something to keep in mind if you're thinking about taking your email list more seriously. I mean, I've been using MailChimp for at least a couple years now and I definitely recommend it. So guys, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Your support is much appreciated and I'll see you in my next video tutorial powered by Squarespace Summit.